Hey, Divine Feminine, this your girl, Hail Feminine, back at you again with another reading. Um, I'm picking up a bunch of distractions. I am picking up some distracting energy where somebody is trying to throw you off. They are trying to throw you off your square. They are basically trying to create a situation where you're not able to do whatever it is that you need to do or handle your business. Spirit is saying whatever you do, um, block it out. Don't pay it any attention because what's going on is some people in your energy is seeing that you're starting to make moves and they want to distract you or they want to throw you off or they want to keep you from doing whatever this is that you are doing. I'm, I'm picking up household or neighborhood or work environment. I'm just picking up a multitude of things, but place the energy where it resonates. It's some people or it's some situations surrounding you that's wanting to throw you off, disrupt you, or keep you from doing whatever this is that you plan to do or you set out to do. And they know that if you have an attitude or if they know if your energy is off, then you won't do it. So it's basically a distracting energy. Spirit is saying, pay it no mind. Um, just count to 10 or whatever you need to do to basically get back to you and bring yourself back towards the goal at hand. So spirit is basically saying, keep your focus on your focus. Don't allow no distractions to throw you off. But first things first, if you would like to get a personal reading, only thing you need to do is hit the description bar. Everything you need to know is down below. Tips and donations are greatly appreciated. Um, thank you guys for donating to the channel. Um, it is helping grow the channel um, and contributing to things that I need to make things better for you all so the messages can get out there. Um, I feel compelled to tell you that this is general, so only take the parts that resonate, leave the rest. If it's not for you, if it's not your story, then don't take it. Um, my readings are timeless, so whenever you get it, then it's for you. Um, it could be your past energy, present energy, or future dated, so only take the parts that resonate and leave the rest. But I'm going to go ahead and pray, and then we can get started. Ancestors and spirit guides are my highest white light, highest good only. I give you full permission to channel through me to give me the divine feminine energy and those who have the divine, what the fuck? <laughs> ancestors and spirit guides are my highest white light, highest good. I give you full permission to channel through me to give me clear, concise, accurate, honest answers and clarity within this reading for the divine feminine collective and those who have divine feminine energy. Also, those who click on the reading. I give you full permission to channel through me to convey the messages and give the energy that is needed. What's T-Spirit? What's going on? What's T-Spirit? What's going on? Ashe, send the collective the energy that they are sending me. Okay, first card out we have is the Two of Cups here in reverse. So, um... I'm picking up the energy that someone is wanting to work with you, but whoever this person is, they don't have any respect for you. So this person basically needs you, but they don't have any respect for you. Spirit is saying this individual is going to basically come to you if they have not already came to you and try to get some information from you or see how you did something or how can they basically get where you are right now. But whoever this individual is, they don't like you. They don't really have positive energy towards you. I'm picking up the energy that you have felt this or you have sensed some off energy about this person. I'm also picking up feminine energy. Now, this doesn't necessarily have to be a woman, but it is coming across as feminine energy. Um, this is strong feminine energy where this person wants to be in competition with you, but they want you to basically show them how you do it so they can be in competition with the skills or the knowledge or the benefits that you have given them. This person is not good for you, Spirit is saying. I am picking up attraction energy. So Divine Feminine, you are very, very attractive and this person is envious of your looks. They are envy envious of your skill set, the things that you do, you reproduce. And this person wants to be like you or they want to basically get the company that you get or they want to get the attention that you get. Whatever this is that you get on a regular basis, they do like it and they have been watching you, but they want you to basically tell them how you, um, basically how you basically what the fuck? They want you to basically tell them how you got this information or how you do it, how you do what you do. Exactly. I can't make this shit up with the um, magician card here. So this person wants to basically, um, wants you to manifest or basically, 
they want you to manifest for them. They want you to show them the ropes. They want you to do everything for them with the magician card here in reverse. But the whole while with the two of cups here in reverse, they don't want to give you any props. So if you have helped this person or this person has already showed up in your life or this person is present in your life or whatever, this person is not going to give you any props for whatever this is. So I am picking up customer clientele. I am picking up close friend where this person asks you for a lot and you do it for them with this magician card but they don't give you the proper acknowledgement or they don't tell anybody that you helped them or this is how they started or this is where they got it from spirit is saying whatever you do with this two of cups here is don't manifest with this person with this magician card here and this um two of cups here in reverse this person is not willing to give you the recognition that you are desired or you are supposed to get i am picking up it's a few people in your energy that like to do that they like to come towards you when it's um beneficial to them and they like to get their needs met but when it's time for you to actually get you know your your gifts or your or you supposed to get your acknowledgement or you supposed to get whatever this is you supposed to get they don't they turn ghost or they turn casper real quick they don't ever give you what you supposed to get spirit is saying whatever you do divine feminine manifest for yourself they're saying don't give to dead end situations exactly with the um with the five of pentacles here in reverse they're saying don't give to dead end situations where there is no equal give and take and reciprocity but more so with this five of pentacles here in reverse and this two of cups here in reverse is showing up is that you are removing a lot of situations that mean you no good so i'm picking up like this don't make no money and this don't make no sense so i gotta get the fuck away from this with this magician card here so i'm picking up the energy that you are starting to choose yourself first with this magician card here spirit is saying you are doing well with the thoughts that you are having so i'm picking up the energy that you are getting ready to align yourself with people and situations that actually resonate to where you're going so spirit wants you to continue to do that the fact that you are pulling the plug on a lot of different situations with this two of cups here in reverse where it don't give you any damn thing with this five of pentacles spirit is saying continue on with that energy because i'm picking up the energy where you were doing a lot of things that were beneficial towards a lot of people and you weren't getting anything now you are aligning yourself or putting yourself in positions where you can actually get what benefits you and you know if it's got something to do with somebody else so be it um with the knight of swords here in reverse is showing up as a fast talker so somebody is getting ready to come towards you that is a fast talker whoever this person is they talk really 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 fast and they basically do this in order to confuse you so this is coming across as a good deed or this is coming across as an opportunity with this knight of swords here in reverse and this five of pentacles now you have manifested a lot of great things divine feminine with this magician card here but but spirit is saying that you have also did this in a place where you are not feeling positive so you have a decoy getting ready to come in to basically present you with an opportunity as if that this is for your benefit spirit is saying whatever you do before you say yes to anything is to read the fine print see how it benefits you or see what this person's gain is or what their aim is basically listen through everything read between the lines read through the sentences whatever you do don't just go around here saying yes they exactly with um Oh, excuse me with the temperance card here they want you to balance out your emotions they want you to basically uh they want you to basically balance out your emotions become grounded rest in your thoughts and your energy so if you feel like you need to make a decision in haste they're saying don't with the temperance card here they're saying balance out your emotions so many words like give me a second to think about it before i say yes spirit is saying whatever you do you don't want to jump at anything you don't want to give off the desperate vibe or you don't want to give off that energy that yeah i need it yeah i i ain't had this in so long or no this ain't work for me oh this is good for me oh let me hurry up and do it spirit is saying relax they saying relax with the temperance card here just because an opportunity comes towards you really really fast allow yourself time and energy to digest you know think on it you know before you go ahead and make a decision in haste with this temperance card here spirit is saying weigh your options as well so if you feel some type of off energy or if you feel like you can have something better than what you're being presented with spirit is saying go ahead and you know move on that with the magician card here they're saying you have manifested a lot of great things but they're wanting you to not be duped they're saying whatever you do they don't want nobody to scam you um fake you out or anything they want you to basically pay attention pay attention to everything um 
with the nine of cups here is showing up as stability. So you are coming across as very, very stable to a lot of people. So the reason why that you are coming across is very much so stable is because you are starting to understand with the magician card here, um, the nine of cups and the temperance card is that I allow the divine to help me. So a lot of you guys are allowing your higher power, um, God, um, the most high spirit basically to, you know, bring things together for you. So you are co-creating with the universe. So now that you are coming across as grounded and stable with this nine of cups here, a lot of opportunities are getting ready to come towards you. I am picking up yes energy. So by you, um, knowing what you want and you're not taking any less a lot of great opportunities are getting ready to come towards you but more so with this nine of cups here in magician card here is showing up this love energy so somebody is getting ready to come towards you whoever this person is they are very financially stable or they have their shit together so if they're not extremely financially stable they have their shit together and this person wants to basically come towards you and you know co-create with you date you take you out this could be platonic and it could also be romantic where this person wants to basically get your time with this magician card here in the nine of cups due to the fact of you have a positive energy or you have peaceful energy or you look really really angelic so i'm picking up angelic energy with this temperance card where you look really peaceful or you look glowy or you look really really beautiful so divine feminine if you have noticed like like things getting better with your skin or your weight or your overall energy spirit is saying it is they're saying you um things are shifting and things are turning over so you're attracting a lot of like-minded individuals um with the four of swords here in reverse it's showing up is that you're not stressed out no more so the fact that you're not stressed out no more is stressing somebody else out um with the uh four of swords here in reverse i'm picking up auntie so this don't necessarily got to be your auntie but i'm picking up strong auntie mama your mother sister your mama sister uh somebody that give auntie vibes or something so if it ain't your auntie it's giving auntie energy so <laughs> whatever that is uh whoever this person is they stress the fuck out because they thought that, that they was going to be able to shit on you i'm picking up the energy where this person tried to humiliate you or embarrass you in front of a group of people with this magician card and this emperor card here where somebody tried to shit on you or say you wasn't gonna never have shit or your life wasn't never gonna be in order or you need to get yourself together or whatever this energy is this person is fucked up on the fact that you are getting shit that you want or things are starting to align for you with the ace of cups here this person threw a lot of dirt on your name a lot of dirt on your back um with the uh king of wands here i'm like this person had like some type of arrogant and nasty energy attitude energy whatever this is like this is coming up as fire sign energy so whoever this person is and they don't necessarily got to be a fire sign but it's coming up as fire sign energy where this person talked too fucking much or they had too much input on your life they had too much input on anything that was going on in your life but the whole but whole time with the eight of cups here in reverse this person wants to come towards you basically to ask you how you do something or or how did you accomplish certain things, you know, or whatever this is. But this person is really sitting back pissed off um, at, you know, for discussing you in a negative way. I'm getting the energy that you don't fuck with this person no more. Like, you either distance yourself, communication is really short, or it's really, really lost. It's like, you don't really give a damn about this person anymore. And they thought that you would basically come back by now with this King of Wands here. And, um, they thought you would come back. They thought you would be calling them or whatever this is. Because I'm picking up energy like you haven't spoke with this person in quite some time and they think that you either gonna come back or they thought you was gonna come back but the shoe is on the other foot now with the eight of cups here in reverse this person is getting ready to come towards you this person wants to manifest with you with this ace of cups here um they want basically to see if they can you know uh rekindle something with the everything is fine card here they know that they have hurt you i'm picking up a great deal of pain that this person has put you through with this 10 uh with this well this is basically the ten of swords well with this everything is fine card here in reverse um they think that since time has passed they think since time has passed um that you should be over it they they think that you should be over everything or you should be over the situation um because time has passed or time has basically come or you know moved away um with the everything is fine card here in reverse so they are fully aware of what they have done to you um with the ace of cups here and the everything is fine uh card here in reverse but they want to try to come back yeah like they want to come back but whenever they do come back or if you do allow this person to come back into your energy with this king of wands they are gonna be like bitchy with you like um um 
why you we ain't talked or why this or why that you know um you must have did this you know it's gonna be like a whole bunch of negative energy like if you do start or you do open up communication with this person they want to basically start some shit with you but they also want to basically pick your brain so this person wants to pick your brain with this page of pentacles because they need something from you they trying to see where you at with them they trying to see like if you mad at them or um if you feel away or whatever this is so they want to like pick with you they want to start some shit with you with this um page of pentacles and this king of wands like this person want to keep up some shit but spirit is saying with this ace of cups here um divine feminine is to hold your composure keep your composure if you have to be in communication with this woman or if you have to be in communication with whoever this person is they're saying keep your composure they're saying whatever you do do not engage with this person they're saying this person is a fool they want to argue but they also need you at the same time so this person is coming across as narcissistic borderline personality disorder this person feels like um that the sun rises and shines on them exactly with the nine of swords here in reverse they feel like enough time has passed and you should basically give them what they want but with the six of pentacles here in reverse it's showing up as this individual has not given you anything and divine feminine you have let go of that energy of being mad about it i'm just picking up the energy like you ain't even mad about it no more with this nine of swords this is coming up as whoever this person is they really really selfish they ain't give a damn about you with this nine of swords here in reverse or the six of pentacles here in reverse they ain't give a damn if you ate or if you had a rat or if you was cool this person didn't care about anything but with the king of swords here is showing up is they wanted you to basically give them everything so i'm getting the energy that you gave this person a lot with the six of pentacles here in reverse and this nine of swords in reverse like you gave them a lot and you didn't think twice about it because you was cool or you felt like because they was family or they was your person or they was whoever they was to you hold on i'll drop my card You felt like that you should basically give it to them. You didn't really think twice about the situation, but they felt entitled to it, indebted to it with this King of Wands here. Spirit is saying this person has a fucked up mentality. They have a fucked up way of doing things. Spirit is saying this person is no good for you. So if this person is not out of your life, then Spirit strongly suggests like you get moving, like you get the fuck moving, like you get rid of this connection, this relationship, like whatever you do, they saying get rid of this shit, get rid of this relationship relationship get rid of this person like this person has nothing good to offer you um they're saying this person doesn't want anything but to use you i'm just picking up using energy usury so this person is a fucking user um what else we got spirit okay with the star card here is showing up is that you are looking really really beautiful you are looking really really attractive um i'm not sure like if you are doing weight loss shakes or if you are doing um detox or whatever this is that you're doing i'm picking up your waistline is slimming down so this is for a specific group of divine feminines who have been dieting or detoxing or whatever this is spirit is saying is working you are very noticeably slimmer so um if you have been doing things like dieting or detox or shakes or meal prep or whatever that is with this star card here um spirit is saying that is working and is working really really fast with this king of wands here they're saying that whatever you have cut out with this six of pentacles it was actually beneficial to you so i'm picking up you either cut out carbs um i think 18 18 so you either cut out carbs um chips soda whatever this is spirit is saying that that is working for you with the star card it's like you throwing away your bad habits and you're starting to get more in tune with yourself with this king of wands it's like you mean business with yourself like you're not letting your slip yourself slip anymore so i'm picking up the energy like some of y'all either slipped on your diet or you were doing things that wasn't right for your health and you're like basically on your own ass right now so i'm picking up it's like you on your own ass and you doing things the right way spirit is saying that that is working for you um but with the six of swords here is showing up as um you're moving away from a hurtful situation i'm picking up the energy like you wanted a certain type of location um whether this was a certain city state or town you're moving away from the idea that that was for you spirit is saying yes now that you are starting to understand that that was not for you things can actually go better for you so they're saying now that you have got rid of that idea that i just need this place or i just need this car or i i just need this relationship you're understanding like it wasn't good for you with the six of swords here and you're starting to understand that you can have better and better is here for you um because whoever 
or whatever the situation was with this king of wands here it was basically too aggressive i'm picking up too aggressive too harmful too tumultuous it was given too much and spirit is saying now that you are understanding with this star card and you're starting to realize and you're starting to see where the divine is coming from and your higher self is coming from things are going to work out better for you especially with this six of swords here they're saying it's okay to cut your losses they're saying you cut them for a reason and they're saying that they're bringing better for you with this star card here Exactly. With the main female card here, Spirit is saying you choosing yourself first is actually bringing things better in for you because I'm picking up the energy like a lot of passive energy where you were really, really um, in the energy of just taking whatever was given to you or you took it based out of being familiar with the situation. But now you're starting to understand like I can have better than this and I don't got to be dealing with this situation just because this is what's uh, for me right now. But I'm also picking up with this six of swords here is that you were in, you were in some type of uncomfortable position and spirit is saying the reason why you was in that uncomfortable position is because you had manifested something better or you wanted something better but now with the main female card here and a privileged lady card is showing up is that you're going to get what you want i'm also picking up a worried ass motherfucker with the message of concern it's somebody in your business that's worried about how you keep on obtaining things i said this in my previous reading like two days ago or a day ago whatever and this person is so fucking worried about how you keep getting what you want or how you keep escaping through the cracks or how this or how that and spirit is basically saying damn <laughs> this is your justice <laughs> this is your fucking justice so spirit is saying like if you was stressed out or if you was worried about a bunch of shit spirit is saying that you don't got nothing to be worried about no more divine feminine like this is your justice i'm just hearing like things are literally about to start getting so much better for you with this courthouse card here and whoever this person is with this concern card here they are going to continue to be so fucking worried and pissed off all i'm just hearing all some along all fall all winter this person gonna be so fucked up on how you keep on getting better how you keep on escaping through the cracks because this person was too invested in your business with this message of concern car here doing shit to try to orchestrate shit to stop you i'm picking up job energy where somebody tried to shave your hours take your hours not pay you i'm picking up situations where you either got kicked out or you was not invited or you were not welcome and spirit is saying it's time after that shit with the courthouse car here I'm hearing that you just won the case. So if you got like a legality situation going on, I'm hearing that you just won the case. Um, you're going to get what you're supposed to get. So Spirit is saying, stop worrying with this concern card. Spirit is basically saying so many words, divine feminine. Stop worrying. A lot of y'all have been worrying too fucking much. And Spirit is basically saying, cut cut it out with the coffin card here stop worrying the shit is over with it's done you're going to get what you want because the most high just popped in a reading with the official person card here ending the reading and spirit is saying that you are going to get what you want i'm picking up the energy like a lot of y'all have been so good to people and you like saying like damn when is it my time damn when i'm gonna get it spirit is saying now because they're saying if you have not understand or you have not understood that the energy is shifting it's, it's exactly hold on yeah, because you have moved away with the Six of Swords. Although that you might have been like, I don't understand why do I keep things not working out for me? Or I don't understand why does this keep on collapsing? Spirit is saying because you have manifested something better and it's going to work in a different place or a different setting or a different town or whatever it is. is. Spirit is saying it's going to work out for you there. So if you have been rerouted, it's for your better good. And Spirit is saying be wise with the mature woman car here and take the opportunity. This is actually for your good. They're saying you don't have to think about it night and day day and night you did the right thing you did the right thing you made the thoughts by leaving the person you made the great thoughts by leaving the situation you did the right thing they're saying you did the right thing especially healing yourself with this occupation card here they're saying stop expecting the worst out of everything everything is not going to be bad divine feminine everything is not going to be bad they're saying that they have showed you everybody in every situation that don't mean you no good so this is why you had to leave because spirit is saying it was not working for you and it was was not going to work for you with the journey car here so spirit saying you have to get the fuck on because whatever this was it was draining your energy and it was draining your time with the thief car here so spirit is saying that the situation was too um imbalanced with the house car here in verse they're saying go away they're saying go away you are going to get some positive news ending ending this reading with this message car you're going to get some positive news this week so whenever you click on this reading or whenever you see this reading you're going to get some positive news with this message car here with the sudden wealth car here is going to come in Really, really fast but that's all i have for you today divine feminine um 
energetically donate to the video by clicking the thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe, especially if it resonates with you at any point. It resonated with you at any point in time during a reading. Um, if you want a personal reading, only thing you need to do is hit the description bar. Everything you need to know is down below. Tips and donations are greatly appreciated. Thank you guys for those who have sold and donated to the channel. I appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys next time.